Welcome to the Geek Easy Lounge, fellow geeks, where today we will be reviewing the comic I liked least this week, which would be Ghost Cage, which is published by Image Comics. It is written by, let's see if I can, Nick Dragata, D-R-A-G-O-T-T-A, and Caleb Goler, G-O-E-L-L-N-E-R, I think this is the artist. Anyway, I'm not quite sure what the hell this book was about. First page right here. Okay, that's just, that's just random. Okay, so there's a power out it. You see this here in big tower here and people saying, hey, there's a power outage. Then we get this dude, okay, from the, the gist of it. This is call me father, okay? So I think he's talking to some this machine that they show a little bit later on in the book, uh, which is controlling the power of this area. It's a this is huge building and it is very good at producing electricity and energy and he is the one in control of it and so he's gonna as a way to exert his power he's going to you know, cut off power when he needs to just to teach people a lesson and all this weird stuff or less the, kind of the gist I get of it. And then you see a plane approaching and they shoot missiles at it. No reason given why this happens. None. It's OHM is the name of the company. And so basically, and it just does damage to it. So alarms are going off, and it's telling computers, telling the people, get out. There's damage, get out or die. I'm not kidding. It, and it says, but there's this one woman here who she's IT, and she's like, oh, I'm not gonna leave because this. If I do a good job at fixing this, I might get a promotion. And dude hears about it, and so he sends her up. She has to get up in some sort of suit. And go up and try and deal with this machine, this this thing which is part of the machine, and fix it to get things back together. I, I don't know. It just this didn't seem to make a whole hell of a lot of sense, at least to me anyway. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it just it was, eh. It was, to me, kind of confusing and didn't make any sense whatsoever and wasn't very entertaining. So I'm going to give it a 0.75 out of 5 and say no recommend. Uh, you know, what can I do? Anyway, let me know in the comments below if you read it and what you thought about it. Like, subscribe, and most of all, enjoy your comics.